Hey, welcome to the commentary portion of uh, the Love You to Death DVD. I'm Alan, uh, the director on this uh, project. This opening shot here, where the grave uh, site reveals Deitch and his tomb, and it cost about 10000 of our $2 million budget. Uh, the shoot actually took about two months um, in five countries, including uh, Reykjavik, uh, Iceland, and uh, Madagascar, and uh, Argentina. Uh, we brought it back for uh, post-production, found that it was all worthless, and so we, uh, we filmed it again in, in southern Indiana. Oh, that's scary. Uh, here's the set uh, that we uh, made. It's uh, not a real cemetery, but boy, it sure does look uh, realistic, doesn't it? Uh, Deitch brought his own state straight jacket to the shoot. I'm not sure exactly why he had one. Boy, he's good. <laughs> it's pretty funny that uh, when I first met uh, the artist known as Deitch, I... I asked him if I could call him Dichi, and he said, No, you son of a bitch, I'm paying your paycheck. You call me Mr. Landicho. But I met uh, the two artistic uh, advisors for this project, um, Narciso Lobo, known as CISO on YouTube, and uh, Adele the Great, known as Adele the Great. And um, it's interesting what you learn about people on these projects. Uh, Narciso Lobo is actually CISO's stage name. Cecil's real name is Cameron McGillicuddy. He's uh, Chicago Irish, which I guess explains why he smelled like uh, corned beef and cabbage. And Adele the Great's name is really Adele the Great. Um, the Great, uh, her last name, comes from the Greek, I'm told, uh, originally Theogreatis, which means uh, God works on spec. And I guess that explains why she smelled like Kalamata olives. I didn't know the the group uh, typo negative before I did this project, um, but I figured since I'm typo negative, um, that it was just destiny that I'd be part of this project. He looks like Shaquille O'Neal, doesn't he? There, anyway. There's the RV where uh, uh, Deech was set up. Uh, during this uh, indoor uh, tomb scene, 24, 20 hours that we shot, uh, Mr. Landicho actually accidentally poked himself in the eye with the candle and um, that's how the uh, the redness uh, occurred. And that was uh, when the cameraman uh, passed out and I just kept the footage. You notice that there's a candle lighting the front of him there and there's one lighting the back and be behind him. The, the light provided in the background is actually another candle sticking out of Mr. Landicho's rear end. Am I good enough? Man, he's good. Now for this shot, I built a, an elaborate uh, round platform that spun and it had an intricate uh, prototype of a camera pri uh, tripod. It cost about uh, 50,000 uh, 50, to, to produce. And the, then Deet said, um, hey, why don't I just hold the camera in front of my face and, and uh, turn in circles? So we did that. Now this end, uh, this last bit with his skull showing, uh, this is not special effects. His skull glows in the dark because of his uh, unique diet. Well, that's it, and um, I hope you enjoyed the commentary. In her place, 100 candles burning. Her salty sweat drips
tears from her breast Her hips move And I can feel what they're saying Swaying They say the beast inside of me Is gonna get ya Get ya Get ya